tense moments today as protesters and counter protesters faced off in East County. A demonstration over racial issues was held in La Mesa two months after protests led to looting and riots there. Police also took extra measures to keep people safe. Fox 5's Andrew Nomura starts us off live from La Mesa tonight. Andrew. Well, Jason, certainly an interesting evening here in La Mesa University Avenue now back open for cars to drive through after it was a different story earlier today when hundreds of protesters took to the streets of La Mesa protesting and advocating for the lives of women of color. Hundreds of protesters take to the streets of La Mesa demanding justice for women of color. Well, Vanessa Guillen, uh, Brianna Taylor. As demonstrators marched, authorities with heavy artillery were close by. Helicopter flew overhead. Authorities blocked the freeway, and the city of La Mesa announced a temporary executive order banning weapons, spray paint, and other items in the downtown area. Vanessa Mazon says she came to promote power and unity in women. Because uh, we are often silenced and we are um, kind of, I don't know, I guess, discouraged to speak up about certain issues because of maybe the roles that we're told we have to play. We saw several counter protesters trying to incite violence. Before nightfall, there were several heated moments. Even though there was a ban on weapons, we did see one counter protester with a knife on his hip. For the remainder of the night, authorities worked to separate the two groups. Mazon says she just wants to keep the focus on women. And I want uh, women to feel empowered to speak up about things that they feel, they feel are wrong. And it doesn't always necessarily need to be about something so profound as uh, police brutality. It could be something as profound as domestic violence within their home. Well, police did confirm that one person was arrested tonight or earlier this evening when the group met and clashed with counter protesters over here by the VFW across the street from the La Mesa Police Department. Once again, at least one person arrested, no one seriously injured. I want you all to take a look at the parking lot here over here in Vons right now. It is currently empty, but about 15 to 20 minutes ago, police were lined up Looks like protecting the Vons here from looters. But I'll tell you this, we were talking to protesters earlier today. They tell us that no looting. They had no uh, idea of looting at all. They just wanted to keep everything peaceful and make sure that their voice and message was heard. For now, we're live here in La Mesa. I'm Andrew Nomura, Fox 5 News.